What's going on guys, Undergrabble here today, welcome back to Europa Universi 4, Uncommonwealth Achievement. So when we last left off, uh, well, we had finished our war with Lithuania as well as with the Novgorod, and yeah, we're gonna, without further ado, let's get started. Now there's been a new update since I last played, like, it probably, I think it came out like the day after I uploaded, so, like, oh, hello. Uh, we already had those caster spellies. Anyway, so what I mean by that is like, uh, like, uh, for instance, um, fabricating claims, um, I'm gonna, it'll take a 20, um, spy network instead of the regular 10, so they've slowed that down enor enormously, and I'm sure there are other updates that I'm not aware of, but that's the one that came. So in this episode, we're gonna try and gain some, like, just chill, get ready for the next war. Hopefully, the King of Poland will die so we can inherit him. Yeah. So that's what we're doing this episode. And we might be fighting the Golden Horde as well. I find that likely. So yeah, I'm just actually going to preemptively fabricate. It'll take a long- it's gonna be take a while, trust me. We're allied to Muscovy, who loves us. And hopefully we can keep that love forever. Nice, we're earning more money. We have the Ottoman down here, as well as Wallachia, Serbia. I suppose we could invest. Yeah, we might as well. Might as well, we're gonna stay Catholic, most likely. We have 33% chance to get it, so we might as well. Oh, my balance screen. Uh, okay, there we go, it's fixed. It was weird, because I thought I had a loan for a second. Uh, Eastern Tech, Eastern Tech, how much I hate you. Someday I will westernize, if I ever get the chance. So, our military tech, like, tech is, like, suffering a little bit, so I'm gonna focus that. There we go. We're, it should go up at the same rate now, which is good, which is how we want it. We're earning 1.34 ducats a month, so... Oh, and your war is over. Cool. We are 14th in the world, unfortunately. Hmm. Who are your allies? Oopzek. Are they powerful? Oobzek. I think they're a faction over here somewhere. Whatever, they're not powerful, it looks like. I could probably easily call Muscovy in to ensure I win this war. Ryzen. You're Ryzen. Okay. Alright, so, hold on. Is this in the Russia region? down here. I want to go expand into Crimea. 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 So, this province, this province, all of those provinces, that's where I want. Lower Dawn. I saw you were fighting someone. Uh, Pomerania, Bohemia, and Silesia. Cool. Oh, what is this? New technology. In admin tech. I think I will. Temples. That'll be useful. I can now build churches. Which is something I've been wanting to do, mind you. So, oh, uh, that's not what I meant to click. There we go. 
Is there anywhere which is worth it? Obviously our capital will be. Uh, here. 0.2 ducats a month, that's worth it. Uh, not really seeing any, I mean, maybe this. I mean, I don't have too much money at the point, so I only want to spend it if it's worth it. Uh, I think I'll hold on to the rest of my money. You never know. I might need to hire a bunch of mercenaries or something. But yeah, that should increase our uh, money wise. So how many, how many units do you have anyway? Nope, that's the wrong one. Kazan. Good, good, good. I want to go to the ledger. Military. Armies. Who has the most army? Not me, obviously, but... So... Uh, Poland, Lithuania. We have just less than Poland. Gor Golden Horde has 21,000, but we also have Muscovy. We'll have Poland, hopefully. And, uh... Maybe... I don't know. Theodoro. Sure. I'm not sure where Theodoro is. We could find out. Theodoro. Oh, that's all the way down. That's here. So actually taking out Crimea, Crimea might also be useful. So I'm going to fabricate on them as well. What's our mission right now? Right, right. I think I have an unlimited time limit on this. I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna act under that assumption. In 10 years, we will um, take them over. So yeah, that'll be fine. Probably have to royal marry them and such, but oh well. Jigelion. But yeah, I'm just waiting for Poland to die. Conquer West Prussia. Hmm. When or oh, when will you die? I kind of want to know this. Where? What am I looking for? I'm looking for here. It looks like my leader will be... He's 21! Zegmuts Jigelian of Lithuania, I think. No... Huh? Uh, what we could do is... They have the same ruling dynasty as me. <sighs> hmm. How to do this? How to do this? Because the thing is, if I have to fight Poland, then I have to fight Hungary and all his friends. I have Muscovy, but that's not going to be helpful. The Ottomans? If I can ally the Ottoman, then I will fight Poland. We might as well try. Must be some way we can get Ottoman. Because if I can get the Ottomans to uh, like me enough to go to war with Poland, then I'll be more than happy to fight Poland. In the meantime, I think I'm going to expand this way and not into Russia.
2.67. Nice, nice, nice. Who are your rivals? Because if I can't get him into a personal union with me, then there's no point being allies, because I need to take him over. Some way. He's a male. I believe. My character is a male. If we can get a female character on the throne, then I should take it. I never found out who their uh, rivals were. Teutonic Order, Bohemia, Ottoman. Hmm. Really would like to be allied with the Ottomans. Mm, hit my mic. Let me just move it. There we go. Should sound a little farther away from it, but yeah. Oh my goodness gra gracious me, Crimea uh, has fallen. Let's fabricate the claim on Bamut. Because it's not in Russia. And we're going to stop building that spy knife work. And we're going to start fabricating here. I mean, we have the CB now, so we can fight them whenever we want, but I think Crimea might be easier first. I mean, I think they, they only have three men, so... Uh, who are their allies? Royal marriages with no guy. Uh, I don't think they have allies. Okay, I can't. I can't miss this opportunity. Then I have to fight them. No. So let's get down here. Supporting Sweden's independence might be useful. Hmm. Do I really want to get involved? Not really. No. I don't really want to get involved in that. We have 400 years to break free to, like, get them, so I'm sure we'll work out something. In the meantime, I think I'm gonna convert this. I might as well. I mean, I have a free missionary, I might as well. Because, like, it's all orthodox and it's causing me problems. It's gonna pro cause me public order problems, but I can deal with that. Churches are done. So my tax income should increase by 0.36, I believe, next month. Yes, yes, you're upset. Do not care. Come on, end of the month. I meant to do a shout out. Oh, ooh, 1.85. Okay, it went up higher than I thought. Okay. I'm happy with that. So you think I have strong allies. Apparently. If I can get my army strength to be kind of equal, then... I don't know if we'll ever get them onto our side. I might have to do a lot of attacking over here before the Ottomans want to be my friend.
Who are their rivals? Yeah, it doesn't help that I'm also allied to an enemy of theirs. Doesn't help. Timurid Persia. Interesting. Waiting, 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 waiting. Yeah, I can't do this before 1460, so that gives me plenty of time to improve their relationship. They're irritated over claims, so well. Deal with them. Twenty-eight years Toba. Here. Here's what I'll do. I'll just stick you over there. I'm thinking because there's all this orthodox land that, for my first idea group, I think I've decided on religious, or even humanist. Because if we do humanist, we can do, like, it's just so good for me right now. Tolerance of heathens, better relations over time, accepted culture, years of separatism, heretics, national unrest, just too good. I think I need it. I know I was talking about innovative, but yeah, I know. I'm going for humanist, I decided. Waiting. Oh, I want to click this so badly because see, like, I'll show you what the update was. See, I can't fabricate it un because I need at least like 20 influence. He's switched this up. It's harder to attack people now, which sucks. Are they still allyless? They are. Let's just preemptively move my fleet. Speaking of the fleet, I'm going to invest in another bark. Oh, wrong click. Yeah, another bark should do because more trade power should be done within a year. Well, it's time to spend papal influence. Who's going to become? 33% chance. I really want to be the Curia controller. Do, 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 do. Yeah, so it's just going to be a quiet episode. I've told you guys this already, but I think by the end of it, we'll go to war with Crimea. By probably, I mean definitely. Eh? Bonquara. Who are they at war with? Are they at war with anyone? They're at war with, against Trebizond. Trebizond's all the, all the way down here. Is Theodoro in this? Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay. Hold on, let me just see the diplomat. Diplomacy view. Ooh, that's a war. That is a war. Rip. 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 Get out of my land. I mean, actually, I would be more than happy to give you military ask access. Uh, we're never going to get that alliance, are we? I think we'd have to fight Poland first, which I can't do, honestly. Uh, 
Alright, I'll edit the poll in the middle. I think I'll do that. Admin power. I'm low on admin power right now, so. I mean, a little bit of inflation isn't bad. It'll tick down if I check. Yeah, I'm sure it'll tick down eventually. Just a. Uh, about one, two months left? Uh. Yeah, two months left. Austria as the Emperor. Hmm. Just thinking. I mean, this is going to be a fun campaign, guys. Oh, we're fifth now. What changed? I think what we need to do is, eventually these, like, Ottoman and Hungary are going to fight, right? And they're going to call Poland in. We're just not going to, we won't get called in. Hopefully they'd force, hmm, I kind of want, yeah, I'm thinking that now we have to take out Poland. Which makes me wonder, what if my ruler dies? Because we might get the achievement, like, it might happen the wrong way around. Which would be bad. There we go. Fabricate a claim. Ah, it doesn't matter which one. Hold on, actually it does to me. So if we do... This is... I'll just do Mansur. It doesn't look like it has a fort. That's why it matters. I don't want to besiege a fort. You still have no allies. You fool. You absolute fool. In ten days we will be fighting. I don't need to call my allies in. We have them blockaded. We'll look at that. Oh, no, no, no. Keep going that way. You go this way. Yeah. Crimea. 6,000 men. Not... It's not gonna be a... It's gonna be easy. It's gonna be a pushover, even. Sieges? Yes, yes, yes. Provincial unrest? Oh. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Oh? Oh, are you going to besiege my lands? Or try to? I will track you down. Don't think I won't do it. I think you're going to here, so I'm going to try and cut you off. We now have the war goal. That's good. This is the capital, it looks like. Yep, the capital. So you're going this way. Very well. Uh, river crossings from... Yedisi... None from my army. Perfect. It's perfect. Yes. No penalty. It's just a flat, straight out fight, which I'm going to win. Yep, stack white. Nice. I am pleased with this. Very, very pleased. Hmm. I don't think we're going to be able to annex the Livonian Order in 10 years. We actually almost have... <laughs> we almost have the battle, like, war almost won, actually. It's awesome. The 
if we can get a wall breach, then we can just take it easily. They're not even building them. Oh wait, hold on. What is this? Let me just quickly create a new unit. We'll leave the cab behind. And you, come. Let's go squish it. Squish. Aw, no squish. No squish. Squish. Yeah, I'm reinforcing 490 troops. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Oh, we did get that wall breach. Awesome. We'll just wait. Water sh shortage. Okay, we're going to attack them. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. No, we're, we failed. Oh well. Whatever. It's not a big penalty. Oh, we did win. Cool. Well, let's enforce our demands. What do we want to take from them? What can we take? This is all in the Crimea. Okay, so we're going to take that, obviously. We'll take here. I think we'll just cut you off for now. We'll take your money. We want you to revoke your cores on our land. Oh. I don't want to pay too many admin points, that's the issue. We're going to be behind tech as is. This is good. Okay, so that's that. That's that war. That's what I was afraid of. I took too much land. Oh well. Whatever. We'll deal with it. Just stay here for now. Okay, so we've successfully taken out Crimea. Diplomat and Holstein. Why Holstein? I'm going to protect in Crimea. Alright, so where's my fleet? There, my fleet. I want you back here. Okay. So, I think that's going to finish this episode off. So, thank you all very much for watching. Take care, please like and subscribe. Comments in the comment section. And next episode, we're going to find out if I need to fight Poland or not. Hopefully not. So, until then.